and robotics activity. Uh, Chris and I were able to join the uh, 10 Spacewalk Club, which is a, a pretty neat thing that, you know, just a, a few short uh, months ago, I didn't think I would do another spacewalk and uh, to now have the chance to have done uh, four more with uh, Commander Cassidy was just uh, icing on the cake for a, a, a wonderful mission. And as I look forward to uh, uh, heading back home for the splashdown, I do uh, uh, think that from a family perspective, uh, my son and Doug's son uh, are really excited not only to get their fathers back, but to get our Apatosaurus, our zero-G indicator that they nominated to go with us on this historic mission to the International Space Station and bringing that to launch and uh, return capability back to the U.S. And so for Jack and Theo, uh, Tremor the Apatosaurus is uh, headed home soon, and uh, he'll be with uh, your dads. Uh, you'll have to pick which one of us is, uh, is your favorite. Speaking of uh, historic moments, uh, we were reminded fairly recently that uh, we're about at the 45th anniversary of the Apollo-Soyuz uh, test project, and uh, which of course uh, was also the last time a, a U.S. spacecraft uh, splashed down rather than landed uh, on land. And it's, it's kind of neat to have that uh, mission that exemplified the teamwork between uh, Russia and the United States, of course, back then the Soviet Union and the United States, but uh, now Russia, and, and to be able to share this expedition with uh, Anatoly and Ivan, uh, the tremendous amount of teamwork that uh, they have put forth uh, over the mission has just been exceptional, and we, we can't thank them enough for their contribution to the success of uh, Expedition 63 and the DM2 mesh, uh, test mission. So, Ivan and Anatoly, thank you. Uh, it's been a real pleasure uh, to share the station with the Endeavour crew, Bob and Doug. Thank you very much for being part of Expedition 63. Two months have passed uh, very quickly, and today, with the weather being favorable, it's time to close the hatches. As you relatively short but very eventful mission is coming to its end. We have no doubt that your return to our planet will be as successful as your launch was. And we wish you a safe flight home, gentlemen. I'm glad that the Endeavour crew has been with us to, for two months. It has been great and interesting time. And uh, I wish you guys a successful return to the Earth. And uh, uh, just uh, say hello to the Earthlings for us. Well, that concludes our, our ceremony. Thank you very much for, for joining us on board uh, uh, the International Space Station. We have uh, a few more activities to do in the, in the, in the day. These guys are about, uh, what would it be, 10 hours or so from, from closing the hatch. Uh, between now and then, we've got a little bit of downtime to rest, and then kind of after dinner, uh, we hit the ground running with uh, all the pre-hatch pre closing activities and the actual undocking itself. So please t stay tuned and, and join us for that. Uh, until then, thank you and all the best well, uh, from the Expedition Crew 63. Station, this is Houston ACR. Thank you. That concludes our event as we count down to 20 continuous years of humans living and working on the International Space Station. Thank you all. Station, we're now resuming operational audio communications.